Sal was running around with your megaphone. Well, let me talk to you about that. Uh-oh. I, I uh, talked to Sal about it. Sal was running around here when he had a bad cold. Ah. Oh. Using my megaphone in the halls. Get close up of Sal coughing all over Howard's microphone. Ah! Oh, sh- oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> I will use Clorox uh, things on You that. should be scared. This is a deal breaker for me. I do not want, I got to be able to trust the guys I work with that they don't touch my stuff. All right. I don't know what you're thinking. First of all, I'm a kook about germs. I'm completely irrational. Plus, you had a cold. Now, I just got a cold. Maybe you gave me your fucking cold. Mm. I don't know. I am just livid with you. Uh, I'm I'm beside myself. I, I don't even know. I mean, there aren't even any words for me. I, it's not a joke. I mean, uh, because this job does mean everything to me. And lately, a lot of stuff has been piling up. I don't want to piss you off. And I just used poor judgment. Why would you? Let's can the, the music. Why 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 would you touch my megaphone? I mean, like like leave my. I don't touch your stuff. I respect that it's yours. Richard and I decided that it would be funny if we, we started going behind people shouting with the megaphones, like surprising them. Fine. So get, get your own, own megaphone. megaphone. Don't right, touch right. my stuff. But, uh, you know what it is, man? Seriously? Your illness about me and your love of me, or obs- uh, it's past love, it's obsession. You putting your hands on my megaphone, it's almost like you're holding me up to your mouth. Like it's, it's uh, honestly, psychologically, you got to get past this, dude. You're whacked out of your friggin' skull. And you gotta stay away from my stuff. It was just, it was just poor judgment. It's not me. I don't. What want else to, are you doing? Are you I going to my ever, office? Are no, you touching stuff? No. I, I hope you accept my apology as sincerely making a mistake. I don't because it's not a mistake. But Sal, There's no I such mean, thing as a mistake. Like this bad judgment you keep pointing to. Why do you think it's gonna get better? Because I know never to touch any of Howard's things again. No, He's, you don't know anything until after you've done it and we told you it was wrong. Is there any time you could avoid some... fucking lawyer? But, he, but she's I'm right. T- I know not to touch your shit, Robin. What is this? Because you apo- don't have judgment, dude. It doesn't... Now you it's know bullshit. not to touch... I'm now apologizing you know. to you. What you're, are you going to do next? When are you, you going to use... Yeah, your what is that? Your apology means what? nothing because it's always after the fact. It's Listen, that you but I made a mistake. Sal, there's got to come a time where you look at that megaphone and say, or, or whatever that's going right. to happen, you go, you know what? This ain't worth it. I'm going to, you got to have some judgment. Right. The megaphone should have never happened is what she's saying. Right. When are you going to be able to read a situation and go, you know what? Fuck, I got to respect this guy's private space. This is a guy who gave me a job and this is a guy I like and this is a guy whose respect I want. This is a guy whose trust I want. You can trust that I'm not going to go into your office and go through your personal things. You can though, but I, I know. I don't want to. The only I, person I'll do that with is Fred. Right. I don't respect his <laughs> personal space, but you <laughs> have to learn to respect mine. Right. And can you? is it fair to say in a year and a half I, I pretty much no, have? No, it's not. Wow. It's not uh, fair well, to say that because well, you just screwed up. Right. Well. And you it, probably have screwed up before. You've probably done no, other things. Just to catch you. No. You right. shut your <laughs> mouth. You, uh, you shut, shut your, your mouth. mouth. All you want, Sal. I'm not shutting my mouth. So just get over it. It's you not know, gonna happen. You know what you like? You like it's not you're like gonna that little happen. weasel behind the it's bully. Not yeah, yeah, gonna shut your happen. mouth. You're it's a little not weasel. Gonna happen. I don't need you chiming in when I'm trying to make a sincere apology. We it's just do not again. right. I'm gonna remind you're being you guys, mean. We do a show. You should be the last person to talk about piling on when somebody's getting the Isn't crap it out of funny? Them. I'm just asking her politely to be quiet. No, and you she didn't ask politely at all, no, so don't. stop that. Whatever. All right. Howard, I know Leave my things alone. And um I just leave Robin's things alone. Leave, Leave Robin alone. All right. <laughs> you could screw with Benji. I don't care. <laughs>